Hello everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel Creator on website. Today in this video I will show you the correct way to add PHP code in your WordPress website. It's very easy just watch this video to the end but before we start the video don't forget to visit our YouTube channel, subscribe, like this video and share it with your friend. Let's get started. Hello again my friend. So like I said today I will show you how to add PHP code in your WordPress website. For this I'm using ChatGPT to create this PHP code to hide WordPress admin bar from your WordPress website. Okay, it's a simple code. I will use it for this tutorial. So I will copy this code. Now I will back in my website. Now my friend, to add this code, you must go to your dashboard. And there is two ways to add PHP code in your WordPress website. The first way is to go in appearance and click on theme file editor. Then go to the function.php and we will add this code in the theme code or what we call a theme function okay like this but this my friend is not the correct way why because like that we have added this code in the theme code and if you update the theme all the code you have added here will disappear okay it will be removed so i will show you the second method that is the correct way okay and for this we will use a plugin we will go to plugins click on add new okay then search for a plugin, name it code snippet. Like this, this is the plugin we will use. Click install now to install this plugin. Then click activate to activate this plugin. Like this, activate. When we activate this plugin, we will find it here, snippet. Now we click on add new, sorry, add new. We passed our code here. Then we give him a name, for example, hide WordPress admin bar. Then we click save changes and activate. Great, we have done. Like this, my friend, we have added this PHP code in our WordPress website using the plugin code snippet, okay? Now, if you make update for your theme or for your plugins, this code will be always in your website and always protected, okay? And the only way to delete this code from your website is to go on all snippet and delete it from here, okay? Uh, of course, you can edit this, uh, this code, sorry, or deactivate it from here or activate it, okay? So it's the professional way and the correct way to add PHP code in your WordPress website. All these codes here, uh, it's coming by default with this plugin. I will delete it, okay, like this. Delete. Great. Like we see, I have deleted all the codes that come in by default with this plugin. And I left just the uh, code that I have added right now, okay? So my friend, this is the correct way to add a PHP code in your WordPress website. I hope this video helped you. Don't forget to subscribe in our YouTube channel, like this video and share it with your friend. See you next time and thank you.